Hello everybody, I am Tom and you are watching me play XCOM Chimera Squad. Um, I said this last time, and I was wrong, but I think this is the finale. Atlas does seem like the, the, uh, the end of the road. This is it, we're going to hit Atlas hard and keep hitting until we take them down. Gear up, roll out, and prepare to make a big entrance. Uh, so this is the team we're taking. Axiom, Terminal, Zephyr, and Verge. Um, Terminal is wounded. Oh, she has a scar, I should say. Um, I guess we'll just see how this goes, to be perfectly honest. Brace for impact. Fucking, that works. <laughs> she crashed through the wall. Alright, first unit through the entrance does plus 3 damage, let's put Axiom through there because he also gets the benefit that he terrifies any mutons that happen to be in there. Um, there's 4 encounters here, which means I don't want to use shit on the first encounter. Keep behind me. Hmm. Aggressive mech, aggressive mech. And then a lot of dudes that are alert. Take it. Nice. Kill the mech if we can. Actually, you know what I will do? So I'm gonna. I can't levitate mechs. So shoot this one. Shoot this one. And I guess punch... Commando, I want to get into the back with her. Mm. Three damage, pain in the ass, but I can deal with it. <laughs> Alright then. Okay. The old blueprint showed an empty area just inside the wall. How was I supposed to know it was Shrike's firing range? We are not all psychic. <laughs> I didn't even... Yeah, I've just noticed that, isn't it? We just drove through their firing range. That's kind of funny. Um, <laughs> well... Let me... Run up here, I think. I'm very tempted. To immediately use my team up. Because Zeph is in a shit position currently. I think I'm gonna do it. It's... Obviously, like, it feels like it's wasting it, but I feel like not getting hit and go and coming out of this encounter unscathed is arguably more useful. Alright, so I've gotten rid of the things that can do area damage. Let's go here. Let's me parry. Oh, smoke. Fair enough. Um. Hmm, we don't use Motel and Juicy yet. Let's stupid this guy, because he's going next. Meh, one round, but whatever. I can deal with that. And then we want to battle madness. Hmm. I wish I could get the bomber, but I can't. I guess this guy. He's gonna be firing into smoke, so he's probably gonna miss anyway, but whatever. Hey, hit. I'll take that. Target weapon in play. Miss. 
Thank Christ. How can he miss such a big target? I don't know, but I'm glad he did. Um, all right. So give one action to Zephyr because by far she can do the most damage. Now. Hmm. Four, three, seven. I don't have to worry about him or him. Smashing Hopefully I can draw fire off the mech by doing this, is my plan. And then we should be able to shoot this guy. Not a great chance. So what I'm going to do is actually going to go lift grenade right here. Grenade out. Doesn't affect the mech, but whatever. I can now shoot this guy. 53 is bad. Sixty-eight is also pretty bad. But see the difference here is it's sixty-eight percent to hit him once. Or it's fifty-three to potentially kill him. And it's fifty-three stacking to potentially kill him. I'm still gonna chain shot it though. I think that's better. If as long as we hit the first one, we're good, but Okay, good. Nice. Oh, you see that? <laughs> Probably gonna get shot by the bomber. The nope, throws a grenade. Makes sense, they're a bomber. And you gonna shoot the grenade? Target spotted. No, he shot me, and I somehow parried that? It's about to blow! Indeed. Bomb is more of a problem, arguably. Fracturing. Damn it. Goddamn armor, I tell you what. He's running towards a grenade, that seems like a poor decision. Okay, to each their own, I suppose. Um. I'm gonna battle madness this man, he just Show reloaded. How you feel. Fight amongst yourselves. Either kill the mech or try and shoot the hitman, maybe. Hitman. I'll take that. Uh one damage is one damage. Let's do a mine flay. Change my mind, shoot this man. Tracking target weapon. God damn it. Of that jackass. They always disable their weapon, it's a real pain in the ass. Um I'm not even gonna reload, fuck you. And stay down. <laughs> Won't slow me down. Yep, that needs stitches. Well, I mean... Bye-bye. And bye-bye. Target kill! I think that's guaranteed to kill him? Um, and it won't trigger Overwatch, because she doesn't trigger Overwatch. That's a thing she does. Or rather, a thing she doesn't? Okay. How's everyone going? Three health missing on Zephyr and Verge. I, I think, think I'm okay with that. You're here. <laughs> God damn it, Whisper. Okay, they know. Get a move on. <laughs> Have to go and jinx I'm it. I'm seeing a lot of activity on the 80th floor. Uh, there's an elevator ahead. It should take you right there. Cool. Okay, so we can blow through the wall. All non-aggressive enemies are surprised. Or we could take the security door. Fewer aggressive enemies. Uh, first unit is marked. Main door. 
Unit through the entrance will receive extra action. That's pretty good. Last unit has a weapon disabled. Huh. I think we do this one? Axiom... Terminal... Throw the ceasefire... Verge... And then Zephyr... Because this will give her an extra action and she can't have her weapon disabled because she punches things. Follow me. So I think that's better. I took ages to decide that for some reason. Okay. So we have two aggressive, a resonant and... I don't care about these. A dominator. Kill the dominator. Because mind control is the worst ability to have done on me. As I said, just kill the Dominator. Um, lift him. And probably advance on... Yeah, I guess the Sorcerer, why not? Tougher than I expected. Wounded is wounded. Ooh, nice. Max damage. Mm. The elevator needs a key card. One of these Shrike goons must have it on them. It's alright, I'm gonna murder them all anyway. There, grab that key card and head to the 80th floor. Interesting. So he goes second... This guy goes third. Okay. Alright, so let's do Adrenal Search. Smashy, smashy. Making waves. Hey, buddy. Really? I got a low roll critical, so he didn't die. Luckily, it terrified him, so he ran away and spectral zombied, so... That took his turn, at least. Paladin... Mind Merge. Kind of perfect. Like, Mind Merge, like, it buffs them, sure. But it also means I can just kill him, and then they both die, so that's a thing I can do. Um... Go Zephyr. Hmm. Yeah. I could get a stun here. Disoriented. Whatever. Take that, it's 89. Mm, didn't kill, but whatever. That's fine. Fine. It didn't hit bone. Um ooh, we can't see anybody. I mean, he goes next, so I guess just kill him? How many people do I have in the neural network? Just him at the moment. I mean, mind play doesn't take bullets, Your so do that. Topics. Hostile pacifier. Hmm. Interesting. This is actually seemingly going quite well. Um, 
Time to reap. Another maximum break. Target out of play. Demolishing. Go to KCON. I don't really want to punch her. I want to kill this guy, but this gets me closer to where I need to be, I guess. Let's use Firebomb first. Then punch. Splintering. Hmm, she ran away. She knows. That'll hit all three. No. Uh, wound. She could have teleported one space to the like here, and then it probably could have hit all of them. Look at that. Four health regenerated. Um. Interesting. I really want to kill the paladin. I mean, I may as well kill this bitch as well. So. A shotgun that big surely would kill immediately, right? Take that. All right, now we want to go safeguard here. Heal up Zephyr. Then we want to move up with Verge because he can't actually see All anyone way. from back here, unfortunately. Move or die. Oh, he can see them. He can't. Ju he just can't affect them with mind abilities. No, he straight up can't see them. What the hell? <laughs> I guess just Overwatch then. One angle covered. Weird. Be ready for anything. That hit. Still noble. You're good. Shattering. And try and shoot me? Yep. Harry, bitch. Hmm, there's any in mechs. Interesting. I'm fine with that, by the way. Because I'm planning on just going up the elevator. Jesus, Axiom. Um. Running gun. For you. This gives me cover from all... I really wish I could get to this spot right here, but I can't. Um, this gets me cover from all of the androids. And take this horrible shot, because if I hit it, amazing. Off target. Kind of just need to book it, I think. Overdrive. Run, baby, run. Um. Like, I need to get to the end. Let's run here. This is dangerous, by the way, but Terminal heals a shit ton, and she has a bunch of armor at the moment. Chain shot this android. Kill it. Shoot the paladin. I want to move up first. There, I guess. It gives I me half it. cover from these assholes. You'll make it. Paladin is 77 now. I'll take that shot. 
Missed it, but whatever, I suppose. Is this amateur hour? Incompetent. Kinda, yeah. He's standing like right in the open. Please keep wasting your effort. Demolishing. Nice. Go parry. Interesting he didn't prime self destruct. Uh, wait, I'm the medic. Um So reinforcements are coming. I can make it into here. And probably get a shot off still. It'll be a shit shot, but I can probably do it still. Nope, I can't. So just overwatch this way. Great, I'm out. I mean Yeah, run away. I kinda just want to sprint to the exit, but the <laughs> She's so freaking slow that it takes me like a million years to get Crossing there. Over. Perfect. Um. I mean, there's not a whole lot. You can get into cover. That's what you can Try do, I suppose. Firing. If you must. Nice. Armor soften the blow. Hit it hard enough, it'll break. I'm not particularly worried. I think I can get out of here pretty easily. Um. I mean, you may as well take the shot. Close, but no hit. You've got another one. Hostile off the board. Weapons dry. That doesn't matter. Just get out of here. On the run. Um. I think I we're good. See everything. This is going pretty smoothly thus far. I'm expecting it to get a lot harder in these second two encounters. I also did burn a fair few resources getting to these encounters, it's worth noting. You'll be completely exposed out there. Well, great. 80 floors and a rooftop is a long way down. For them. Yeah, it's also a long way down for you. Uh, low visibility. Hmm. Um, I th think we go... Verge. Axiom. Ceasefire. Terminal. Reef. Nah. I don't even need the refresh yet. Because I think... Verge is the only one hit, so I think we, we just breach fire. Alright, cool. Surprised, surprised. You are aggressive. Shoot. Damn it. It's potentially killed there. Um, 65, 51. Take the 65, I guess. Guardian, Acolyte, Acolyte, Guardian. Punch the Acolyte. And then finally... Shit, this Attic has potentially kill it. Oh, it's weapons disabled anyway, it does get a shot. Son of a bitch. I always run into issues when I try and save my... ...abilities. So, let's just banish this Guardian. Not a great start. Find an angle. I did kill him though. Interesting that I can tell, because you see down in the bottom left with my ammo is, I have two bullets left. 
which means he only took um, five bullets to kill him. There you go, as I said. Nowhere to run. Eh. Annoying, but I can deal with it. Alright. Uh, who goes next? This Acolyte goes next. So... I'm going to Adrenal Surge. Punch this guy. In the party. Deflection. Still the damage to him, which is hilarious. Um, Alright. Now I think we run and gun. So ready for this. Hey, bitch. Make way. Hostile kill. He was happy about it. Um, punch this guy and kill him. Still parry, why not? Terminal. Add her up next. You got 200% chance shots. It's definitely dead. Pain in the ass that it took both shots, but I'll take it. Reinforcements are coming, which means I should head up. Stupid this man. Your thoughts are mine. Next time ain't for my head. Don't let it get infected. Armor soften the blow. A good effort. Nice. Target down for good. Damn. Um, literally just sprint up as fast as you can. You are really slow. <laughs> Is that five mutons? Praetorian. Bomber. Bomber. Uh, berserker. Not berserker. What are they called? Um, bomber. I can't remember what they're called. Alright, well, he can't see anything from here, unfortunately. Repositioning. Battle banners, please. A flank shot on both of them. I'm pretty sure as much damage on the Praetorian as possible is probably a good idea. Unfortunate. Alright. That's fine. You're making me unable to miss with a shotgun. Incompetent. I thought Jewel meant he couldn't miss. Grenade. Huh. Kind of annoying, but I think I fine ultimately. Run. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> you are in grave danger. Uh, that gets three. It's annoying. Um, I'm gonna run up and hit three. Which is dangerous as fuck, by the way. Mutons are scary, but... Thinning crowd. 
Rooted, weapon disabled, weapon disabled, I'll take it. Parry. Grenade oh. downrange. I think the bomb is gonna blow <laughs> up Verge. There's not a whole lot I can do about it. Parried, bitch. Mm. No damage. permanent damage. Hey. Need me to take a look? Probably. Um, alright. Axiom. Yeah, probably cooperation on Axiom. I want to kill the Praetorian as much as possible. Uh, relocation disc. It's most over the top animation, I love it. Um, Praetorian needs to die. Departure. That's some tough armor. At least you didn't miss. Alright. Then wanna do second wind on Verge, because he's taking some damage. Also, there's reinforcements coming. Oof. Another scar for Good my dodge. Direction. Necessary dodge. Moving on target. What the fuck? Really? Moving to location. I'm gonna have to replay this one. This is just too many enemies. What the fucking fuck? Um. Motel inducer, because we need it. Literally have no idea what to do here. I really wish I had crowd control. Let me punch something that gives me cover. How how about that? I mean, it's not good, but it's better than nothing. Stunned, I'll take. Parry. Alright. Battle Madness. These are my options. Uh, the Cobra, I guess. Target. Stupa on the brute. Okay. Praetorian needs to die. Armor soften the blow. Wounded is wounded. This should take him out. Which gets rid of some of the armor on these fucking mutons. Hostile isn't moving. Nice. Adhering target. Hmm. I think I can deal with that. <sighs> Still one turn. Who goes second from here? I think I actually reap here. Time for some as snooker. silly as that sounds. Because I can take out this guy, definitely. Smash the hostile. Don't let it go to your head. I did that in the wrong order. Because now my punch is doing four to 
five. Eh, nah, it's still guaranteed. This Cobra. Fracturing. Rooted. Unfortunate. It's hoping for a stun, but you know. I forgot. I don't get fucking bullshit when I do that. By which I mean I don't get parry. That's wide. Let's hope for luck. It's my only choice here, really. Good, go for Axiom. Shoot Axiom as much as you like, I don't care. Oh, don't do that, though. Off the crest. Apparently I can see people from here, which is good. Second wind. Nothing beyond our reach. Yep. Losing blood. Lucky I healed. A lot of blood. You are still up. Good. Um, how many people do I have? Three. Um, let's just stupor the pi. Eh, yeah, stupor the python. Your mind falls away. Because that gives me um, Axiom back. No ammo. No ammo, huh? Adrenal Surge. Am I rooted still? <laughs> yeah, I still am. Okay. Um, sure. I don't know why it's moving the camera over here all the time. It's a pain in the ass. Pain in the ass. I agree. How did you miss that? Hello, neighbor. I'm fine. It didn't hit bone. How is he not raged out yet? There we go. Armor soften the blow. Wounded is wounded. I've had worse. No, you haven't. You're dying. Why keep me around? It's pretty good. I'll bring you down. One, You're two, three, four. Parry. I should have healed before I did that. Would have been the smart thing to do. I'm an idiot. I'm gonna die. I have a healing kit on her. I could have healed. Yeah, attack Axiom. Yeah, there we go. Off the crest. He heals all that back. Don't let it get infected. Ugh, that's a stink of organ damage. <laughs> uh, that's not good. That's not fucking good. Oh fuck. You weren't making my job easy. We're going into the last battle without our best unit. <sighs> hey, I get to show off the mechanics though, because now I can use the uh now I can use the uh goddamn android that I spent all this time building up. Not long now. Uh, flesh wound. This is why you keep me around. 
Really? You can hit from there? Stay with us. Alright. Battle man is here. Oops, I stunned. I wanted to do battle madness, whatever. Mind flay. Yep. Multiple hostiles down. I'm about to burn up. Move, move. move. All right. I kind of want to punch this guy, because I think it kills both the python. The python and it does damage to the bomber. Hostile off the board. Yep. Next time aim for my head. Yep, that needs stitches. Mm. Fine, it didn't hit bone. Not fine. Off the crest. They think you an appealing target. I'm gonna have to reset this. Still up, but barely. <laughs> Axiom is bleeding out. He's no this longer burning really though, empty. so that's fine. Um, stabilize him, please. Uh, see, the thing is, if I beat this encounter now, I'm going into the last encounter with three dudes, and then I think I have to reset the entire mission. Go! Go now! <sighs> I guess we'll think about it. mind over yours. My mind overwhelms you. One less hostile. Neutralizing. Good shot. I am hit, but still standing. Fucking shotgun, but whatever. Need me to take a look? Ammo's nearly out. Moving, cover me. Give me your mind. I'm gonna see if I can take this on and just see what the fuck happens. This can't be good. I'm going in with effectively three guys. One, two and a half guys. Well, I only have one, so... <laughs> I got an achievement. Great. Uh, 25 defense. All units entering here get 25 aim. All units get 50 dodge. 
I think aim is better for the most part. Twenty-five defense is better than dodge. Time to breach. This is gonna be a shit show, but we'll see how we go, I suppose. That's a Ronin. And a Thrall. And an aggressive Praetorian. You can get it levitated. Take out the Thrall if you can. Perfect. Sorcerer. Another Praetorian. Another sor We're not going to be able to do this. Let's give it a shot! On your arms. It's Chimera Squad. And screw you for all you've done, pal. All I've done? I've reminded this city what it needs to survive. You don't know what you're talking about. The elders will return. We can only defeat them by tearing the weakness from our hearts. Was that why you killed the mayor? A handful of casualties today, or a whole world tomorrow. It's an easy choice. He stalls for reinforcements. We should end this now. You won't acknowledge the stakes? Fine. Shrike, destroy them. Fucking Parada. I guarantee it's fucking Parada. Um, okay. Motel inducer terminal, sure. Take the chain shot, hopefully hit it. Cool. Uh, stupor. The Ronin? Your thoughts are mine. And then shoot Sovereign. Really? Oh, yes, Stasis. Okay, uh, that's alright. I was gonna say, what the fuck? Her resolve lights the Jesus air. fucking Christ. How did a thrall hit me? This thing is nearly empty. Okay. Safeguard here. He'll be fine. He won't be. He's gonna die. <sighs> Kill him. That's it. You're done. I can't. I literally can't deal with reinforcements. Verge is going down right now because that melee strike will kill him. Oh, not quite. But it's close. Took a hit, but I still stand. I still stand. Yep, that needs stitches. Right. I have some choices here. Nice try, jackass. Here's next. Sorcerers. Kill the thrall. I'm 
It's fine. Beat up my android. It's Damage perfect. It's four armor. She sees you. Damage taken. That goes through armor, but whatever. All right, here's my chance. Battle Madness, the Praetorian. Cease Firebomb. Eh, Cease Firebomb is useless. Puppeteer and hope for the best. Follow my lead. One. I got one. He's probably gonna take out Verge anyway. You're dead. Nope, he went for terminal. Fantastic. Blood on my jacket? Ugh, again? Stay focused. Safeguard, Verge. Operation on Verge. Um, the reason I'm doing a corporation here is just to run the fuck away, but, like, <laughs> run the fuck away where is the question? Because he's just gonna chase, presumably. No, he didn't. Disabling the praise weapon. At least I could treat my own wound. We will move. Okay. Right. Good critical. And try and take out Verge. Another for the hunt. That was unpleasant. No match for Blade. God, the Ronin goes a lot. I feel like they get two returns per thing, because I haven't used Praetorian yet at all. Um. Kill the Sorcerer. Seriously, what the fuck can I do here? Like, I can shoot this person. There's fifth to after all those people. Yeah, I mean, throw the ceasefire grenade, because why not? I need to start doing damage to the Ronin, to be perfectly honest. Yep, just do as much damage as you can while you can. Great, I'm out. Verge is down, which means I lose the mind control. Alert. Ally down. D 
damage to frame. Hostile armor deflection. I like how calm he is. For now. Can't touch this. Damage taken. Alright, so I need to stabilize. Also need to heal myself, probably. Sixty-two... Kinda have to kill. Missed, perfect. Ha! You got nothing on me. Reload. Reloading weapon. Hostile armor deflection. I pulled him out of cover. Fuck. Blood on my jacket? Uh, again? It's fine. He missed it's even better. Hostile missed. Can't get a fucking flank. Um I may as well do a cooperation here first. C7 is bad. Safeguard yourself instead. Low ammo. Hostile armor deflection. Damage taken. That'll do damage. <clears throat> that hurts. Hundred percent on a chain shot. Take it. And do a lot of damage. That's not enough. I need to kill the Praetorian. No ammo. I think. We're going to do here, do a flank shot on this sorcerer. Except I can't, because I'm an idiot. Could not arrest. You do not belong. Damage bypassed. <sighs> She's going down. Enough of that. Sustained. Badass. I forgot I had that ability. <sighs> I should heal myself first. I'm a fucking idiot. You see that? Oh, I can anyway because I have the thing. I forgot about that. Jesus. Uh, if this no isn't the end, I'm fucked. Reloading weapon. Bad shot, but taken anyway. Missed hostile. Damage to frame. Weapons dry. Safeguard yourself again. Give it to Claw. Him up, you knock him down. Claw is clutch. That amount of armor has saved my ass a lot of times. If this isn't the end of the mission, we're fucked. And honestly, I don't think it is the end of the mission. It is. Oh my god. Oh, I cannot believe I did that. My reading was fair.
Oh, Jesus Christ. Atlas defeated. Atlas is no more. But yet, you captured all kinds of intel on their plans and operations, including the death of Mayor Mi Nightingale. City 31 can rest easy tonight. Now get back to base. The director has authorized some much needed R&R. &R. Yeah. Jesus. That was a fucking fun mission, though, I tell you what. It's the first time I've been really pushed like that. One month later. Chimera Squad. The director has arrived. At ease. One month ago, you were understaffed, outgunned, and in temporary housing. Hey, the place had character. And rats. Don't forget the rats. <clears throat> now, the entire squad is here, with the latest and greatest from XCOM HQ. City 31 is in good hands. Hostage situation in Old Town. We'll need all hands for this one. Chimera Squad. Form up and load in. I'm sorry for interrupting. You made my point. Go on, do your jobs. Reclamation is entrenched. Our assets burned. We have no options. The battle for City 31 is lost. But XCOM doesn't realize they're already at war. And when they do? It will be too late. Not sure if I'm supposed to recognize those voices from, like, the radio or something. Alright. Difficulty expert. The 5th, the 23rd of the 5th, 2040. One flawless mission, 55 missions won, 363 kills, 450 captures, 13 agent scars. Uh, I think three of them were from the last mission. Um, five match rank agents and 83 campaign days. Cool. And then we've got the credits. It was a really good game. I liked it a lot. Um, it was not as in-depth. These are cool credits. It wasn't as in-depth as um, like mainline XCOM games, but that simplicity kind of added to it, I feel like. It, it, it made it more, um, I don't know, streamlined, I guess, would be the way of describing it. It's really cool art. Uh, yeah, so, if you like XCOM, definitely worth picking up, because it is literally, effectively, just XCOM. Also, there is some replayability here. Um, I was worried that the replayability wouldn't be as high as regular XCOM games, because you can't create your own units. But, you don't get all of the units in a playthrough. Like, there's a bunch of dudes that I didn't get that I know, like, are characters in the game. Uh, so, it's interesting that, like, you can, depending on which characters you select. Also, I think if you don't do the tutorial, it gives you random characters at the start, too. But it's interesting in that you can go through and play with completely different characters. So it is still got some replayability. Like, I think you could probably do three or four playthroughs of this. Um, not as much as XCOM, but I was thinking this would be like a one-and-done kind of thing because of the pre-made characters. But seemingly not. Seemingly, it's probably, I would say, at least two, probably three or four, I would say, playthroughs for, to get like the entire... The entire game out of your system, if that makes any sense. Alright, then we've got the credits rolling. <sighs> Let's have a look at this team, actually. It's not a big team by the look of things. You got four leads, two production. Uh, two producers, I should say. One, two, three. Like eight on the design team, and then. Yeah, it's a, quite a small team, actually. Yeah, like their art department's the biggest department. Huh. I guess there's probably a lot of stuff that they could have, like, just carried over from previous games, like placeholder assets and things like that, so they don't have to worry about too much. But. It's interesting. It's a much smaller team than I was expecting. In any case, um, I think I'm probably going to leave that, but that's going to be it for XCOM. Um, as far as videos going forward, it's now going to go to uh, Divinity Original Sin. I'm going to upload Divinity Original Sin until Baldur's Gate 3 Early Access comes out, and then I'm probably going to switch over to that, because I'm way too excited for that. Um, 
but yeah, we're going to see how far we can get in Divinity by doing it daily. So we'll see how it goes. I don't think I'm going to be able to get Divinity done before Baldur's Gate comes out. Because Baldur's Gate comes out on the 30th of September, which is um, just over a month away. Like five or six weeks from the point of my, my recording. Um, when's this going to get uploaded? 23rd? This video is for the 20th, 23rd that this gets uploaded, I think. Is this the Sunday? Yeah, so there'll be like a month of XCOM. Like five weeks of XCOM. It's like 35 episodes. Uh, maybe. I might be able to get Divinity done. No, not XCOM, Divinity. 35 episodes, right? Well, no, because you take one out a week. So it's like 30 episodes. Yeah. That'll put me to episode. Yeah, I mean, it'll be close, actually. Because where are we sitting? We're sitting almost at the last act. The last act goes a bit... I could actually get Divinity done before we start Baldur's Gate as well. That would be quite cool. Just so we can have some completed uh, series. I'm just rambling at this point. Feel free to end the video because I'm probably just going to continue rambling about random stuff on my channel as a credits roll. But I always like to show the credits in games like this because you got to give uh, appreciation to the people who actually went through and did it. And made it. Um, yeah, but it's... it's. I think Divinity might be able to get done. Um, if I'm really close to the end of Divinity, I'm not going to just do everything on Baldur's Gate. I'll keep like the weekend slot or something. I'll just finish out Divinity if we get really close to the end. Um, but yeah, it's going to be pushing forward. And then I guess after we've gone through Baldur's Gate early access stuff. Which... I've been told it's about 20 hours of content, but I think that 20 hours of content is probably, like, not all of that is going to be in one playthrough, and I think what I'm going to do is one playthrough and then a bunch of build guides and stuff like that um, is going to be the mainstay of what we do for that series. So I think, like, one playthrough won't take 20 hours. Um, but in any case, after we've done, like, the mainstay let's play part of that early access, I'll move on to back to Witcher. And we'll do Witcher Daily until we get to Cyberpunk release, probably. I've got all this planned out in my head. How well it actually turns out is another thing. Because um, it really depends on timing for a lot of this kind of stuff. But anyway, thanks for watching this series, guys. If you like this video and this series as a whole, please leave a like. If you aren't subscribed, please consider subscribing. And as always, thank you for watching, and I shall see you next time. Also, if you did enjoy this series, um, I've also got a full playthrough of XCOM War of the Chosen as well. XCOM 2 War of the Chosen, I should say. So that's worth going back and having a look. Um, as I said, more in-depth those games. They're bigger and they're more um, expansive, I would say. Like, there was a lot of simplified aspects in this game. Like, the base building and stuff was very, very simple. Um, to the point of effectively non-existent. Uh... The missions themselves ended up being a lot shorter in general. Um, towards the end of XCOM 2, you get some missions that go easily for an hour. Um, I think in this game, I probably had one or two that went for an hour. Um, nothing close to like the ridiculous amount that you could get in XCOM 2. Like some of those XCOM 2 missions, like literally an hour and a half, two hours of going through a single mission. Granted, I'm slow as hell because I think everything through well before I do it. Except when I don't and then admonish myself for it. But, you know, it's the way things go. <laughs> but I think I'm just going to let these credits roll out, and that's going to be the end of the video. So, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Alright, and with that, we're done. So once again, thank you for watching the series, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.